have you ever seen this before? A QR code on a piece of fruit. Why is it there? What does it do? What does it tell us about the digital tools and the power of modern farming here in China? Well, it's pear season right now, and we are going to get to the root of all these questions. Dangshan County in Anhui Province, East China, is the pear capital of China. Pears have been cultivated here for over 2,500 years. Each year, about 1 billion kilograms of pears are produced here and sold across China. In 2020, Dangshan began to explore and create a traceable system for its pear with blockchain technology. Individual QR codes mean that customers can trace the origin and growing process of the pear. And that's not all. The Internet of Things has also made planting pears smarter too. This orchard stretches for around 16 hectares and is managed with the help of big data, Internet of Things, and environmentally friendly prevention and control processes. My son, this is a construction site. 啊，建设站，嗯、呃，它旁边的这个呢是重庆的一个建设站，另外呢，我们那边还有这个土壤的建设站，呃，通过这些农业物联网设备的这个使用呢，呃，就可以实时的检测和分析这个梨树的呃生长的环境和实时的一个生长情况。我们这个梨园的果农呢，还可以通过手机，呃，可以远程控制灌水和施肥，这样就大大的可以提高。我们梨园的一个科学的管理和智能管理的一个水平。E-commerce is really helping to boost the sales in Dangshan. By the end of 2020, more than 2,000 companies established an online presence, and over 100,000 people are employed in related industries. E-commerce trade volume exceeded 6 billion yuan last year. 我在二零一七年退役返乡创业，从微商到平台电商，一直到短视频电商，我们不断的创新电商新的玩法。我们现在每天的日发货量在一万单左右，售卖当单速率五万多斤